Now we are going to see an example on exponential growth. Suppose the population of a town is following the model PT equals 2500 e raised to 0.0293t. And the question is how long does it take How long does it take for the population to become 5000? How long does it take for the population to become 5000? Here the population itself is given to you as 5000. So I'll just substitute or replace this PT or the population as 5000. So replacing PT as 5000, you have been given this value as PT. This population is given to you as 5000. And this is equal to 2500 e raised to 0 0.0293 times t. It's an exponential function with the e raised to e 0 0.0293 because of this t, this pt becomes an exponential function. Now to solve such question, first of all we need to bring this t at the linear position which is, which is already at the exponent position. We will bring it at the linear position. To bring this t at the linear position, we will use logarithm. But before that, we need to eliminate this term 2500 from here. So to eliminate this term 2500, we need to divide both the sides by 2500. Divide both the sides by 2500. So what you have done, divide both sides by 2500 or whatever is the coefficient of this exponential term you will divide both the sides by the coefficient of the exponential term so this gets cancelled here 2000 times 1 2000 times 2 so here you are left with 2 equals e raised to 0 0.0293 t take log both the sides log 2 equals log of e raised to 0 0.0293 times t. Now we know that log of m to the power n equals n times log of m. So this power becomes linear and it gets converted to log 2 equals 0 0.0293 times t log of e. We are using log, it means we are using it to the base 10. Now, we want to get the value of t. We are looking for t. So whatever is attached to t, we will try to eliminate that term. To eliminate that term, we will divide both the sides again with the coefficient of t that is 0 0.0293 times log e and this side also 0 0.0293 times log e so on the left side you are left with log 2 over 0 0.02 this is 2 0 0.0293 log e and this is your t. Now if I look for this value, log 2 is 0 0.3010, 0 0.0293 times log of e. If you substitute the values, this gives you t and it comes out to be 23.65. Or 23.65 so approximately say 24 years so after 24 years your population is double 
of the initial population. Initial population is always P0. If you substitute T as 0, T is 0, this term, this term becomes 0 and the initial population is 2500. To make it more simple, the term which is attached to the exponential term is always your initial population or the initial value or the principle for the given exponential function.